Hello everybody, my name is Marchi and we are back in our beautiful horror game Outlast. Now last episode was uh, quite joyful. I'm continuing play. I'm continuing playing after it. I'll try to play it now how it's supposed to be played. Slowly. So you can feel the tension, the fear, the hanging person from the ceiling. <laughs> Chris Walker is still alive. I forgot about him. Oh my god. I knew it. I knew that there was something sketchy about the game. Not sketchy about the game, but about the ending. Because in last time we found Dr. Wernick. We found Dr. Wernick. We were chased by him and we also he died during an accident while chasing us. He was also the main protagonist, the main bad guy of a game. I was kind of sad when he died, but you know, eventually it would happen. Wow! <laughs> I I, I knew there I knew that there that it's too easy because we need to turn off two more wells. There has to be something again that will keep us interested, not interested, entertained. For a um, couple of more, maybe hours. Hour or two at least. Oh, wait a second. Sorry. My control key just fell off. Breathe. Get your breath. Okay, now you go there. And I will go right. Take a slice of that guy. Okay. Shit. He turned around. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Please. Don't. Don't. Duck. Maybe he can't see us through this dark glass, dirty glass, but there's a lamp here, which means he could see us now. Do you know how to get out of here? <laughs> I'm just breaking probably. This is my attention talking right now. Psychological trick to calm yourself down. Ah, it could be. I mean, you're not fighting this big dude. No, no hard feelings. I'm no, just joking, guys. We're both, we're both in this mess. You and me. Everyone. All together. Okay, I'm missing something, yeah. Maybe I um, turn in the wrong way. We need to go here to the left. Oh, we made a full circle around over here, so we need to go there. Yeah. Should we wait to see where he's going? Maybe not. We'll see if he turns around. I think we're good. Two lockers here. What's this? Uh, laundry room? This is sprinkle well. Number one. I'm gonna leave the door open. So we can use this door. 
If you're gonna run, I think he left. I think. Can I hide here somewhere? I just want to test this game. I want to check check to see if he's having a patrol through this hallway. To check this in a safe way. Okay now while we're waiting for him. Where we need to go now. Hello, Chris. Long time no see. Did you hear the news? Dr. Wernick is gone. No, you didn't hear it. You don't read newspapers because you don't know how to read. You're dumb as F. Now, what did he do? What did he do just now? What was that? He need to go through that to this room. Wait, I can see him maybe. I'll wait for another round. I'll see you in a second. No. But I don't know where we need to go now. That's the thing. We should have more stamina than him, right? He's a fat dude. He's a big guy. How time is that shit? Oh, he saw us. Oh shit, because of that. Oh fuck, he didn't. I said that he was dumb. Shit. I washed my feet, you can't sense me. I'm coming back to this section. Oh, there he is. Can we squeeze through here? We can. I thought that we can't. Okay, this is probably way too second well. Sprinkler, yeah. Oh. Look for a well, guys. Okay, I'll just peacefully wait. I will just be you know, waiting around the corner. Just take care of your baby. Bloodbath. Literally. The guy is insane. <laughs> okay. So this is second well. Can 
Can you take? Oh, this is a map. I thought that it was a shovel. Okay, but why do you need a? No complaining now. We have to wash every little part. Oh, oh, who's a clean baby? Who's a clean baby? Oh, you are. Yes. There you go. Shh. Now you can see what is love when you see it. You recognize it, don't you? And I was thinking about the shovel. I want to take a shovel and, and bump and uh, hit him with it. <laughs> or maybe Chris Walker. But I think the shovel is not enough for Chris. Now speaking about Chris. <laughs> yep. Speaking about him. It's a nice little dummy, ain't it? You're working out. <laughs> I need to make a fun of him. Really? Really? He stopped. Oh, he didn't stop! <laughs> he didn't stop! No, we don't have a doors in... And this thing... Like he can't squeeze through this thing, right? <laughs> you can't squeeze through, huh? Huh? Ah, I see you. Ah, hello. Yeah, leave. Leave. Hey. <laughs> oh. Don't worry guys, we know exactly what we're doing. Exactly. Now gently. Calmly. I didn't catch that fine Martin Martin radio But maybe not in here not in this burned cafeteria okay I need night vision to see where we are going. Uh, uh. Really? Oh yeah, we came through. Wait, is there? Uh, find Father Martins outside. Where is the exit? Sure, no problem. Ah! Oh fuck, you motherfucker! Oh! I was like for a second, like who's that on the ground, the fucking corner? Oh! Did you see that? No, sorry, wait. Have you seen that shit? The first guy with the beard. <laughs> Jesus Christ, the scared. The 
In my mind, it was all over. I was thinking, okay, the calm kitchen silence were clear. We need to go through this. Uh, I thought that this was a little elevator, service elevator or something. We'll just board that thing up and we'll go. Wait. Holy shit. And the exit is on the left. That's not looking good. Any documents? Yeah. The last one. God forbid the last one. Not the last one, the, the final in this game. <laughs> My culture program, CIA more document number 140401. PP. <laughs> Did I actually read that? Okay. 159 excerpt. Except points, whatever. Two file subject, special research Bluebird. First, general problem. For the past several months, Bluebird has <laughs> been endeavoring to ascertain by research, study, instruction, and some practice that the value, if any, can be derived from CI, sleep induction, and age hypnotic techniques when applied to war and specific agency problems. Three, can we create by Post hypnotic control an action contrary to an individual's basic moral moral principles. Maybe this third question explains everything. So this was a CIA project about uh, creating uh, control over a human being by using a post hypnotic techniques, which will give a control over individual to do an action contrary to an individual's basic moral principles. That's what, there was one letter that we, uh, we read uh, that uh, was explaining that one girl took a gun and tried to shoot another girl because she didn't, she couldn't wake her up. But in, 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 the, in the conscious state, she hates weapons. She could never even uh, ha grab a gun, ha handle a gun, you know, the even empty one. So with the sleep induction and hypnotic techniques, the CIA is gonna... Is trying to force people to do some certain things. Seven. Can we guarantee total amnesia under any and all conditions? Yep. If if CIA hypnotize someone and that individual do something, CIA wants a total amnesia over him, so he can't sing. If you know what I mean. Can we alter a person's personality? How long will it hold? Yep. How long will these hypnotic techniques hold a person in that uh, state? 17. What are full details on a sleep inducting inducing machine? Machine. Machine. Sleep inducing machine. What's a sleep in inducing? I can't. I know a certain meaning of that inducing sleep inducing uh, that will be something like sleep inducing machine the machine that will put you to sleep am I right I don't like this are these marines? No, this should be Father Martin because he has a flashlight. He had a flashlight when you saw him. I can't see anything. Yeah, I turn on night vision. It sounded like the devil himself fly over us, flew over us. The 
door needs a key. I need a key for that. You serious? God damn key. Why did I ever come to this place? Why? Yeah, reload batteries. I can see anything. I'm, I'm imagining how you're gonna see anything. How alive are you? <laughs> Good question. Okay, time is stopping. And we read documents so one can get us our own personal cavalry. Cavalry. I don't even know your name, but I've come to think of you as one of my blood, my Paul. I hope you don't mind. And I hope you don't indulge the vanity of self pity. The fear that you're suffering is more than others. We all must endure this, and you are nearly done. There's no way to heaven but by my by but by the cross. And every man needs another to help drive the nails in. I'm here for you. I'm waiting. Ahead. Is this priest really a good Is he a buzz good guy? You're waiting ahead, but where? Because these both of these doors are chained. Can I jump over? No barbed wire. Thunder. Called it. Or I should say lightning. There's a cabin in the asylum's backyard. I asked a question in the wrong time. In the right time. Maintenance shed key. Was that the ghost? No, 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 don't give me ghost shit. Are this door? Yeah, this are okay, we just fell in a fountain. I won't even look around. Open. Getting okay, close, close, close. door on this side and I want to check this side maybe we'll find another battery or something no hold on what is going with the Are we going crazy? Hearing things, seeing shit? Or hearing shit, seeing things? The same thing. <laughs> there are other batteries. Oh boy. We have a note to read. The thing in the dark. God help me, I think I've seen the wall rider. Nah, boy, you didn't see anything. 
I mean, we don't. I don't even know what Wall Rider is. I think we didn't see uh, an official explanation or description of a Wall Rider. Are we gonna go through this year? I don't have a battery for a camera. <laughs> Our night vision rage is um, heavily. Uh, what? It becomes short. Where the hell are we? Oh, give me, give me, give me, give me. Scaffolding? Now we came from. I mean, I would never, never find this door without this battery. If he didn't find the battery. Okay, focus on your goal. Oh, we can do it! Just follow the light. Have to get out. I know. Thank you for for your advice. Maybe Dr. Vernick uh, Taggart Taggart's ghost Come here to visit us? How do you know that you're not a problem? It's a good question I mean technically we are We were his problem Or Dr. Vernick's problem Wait We are at the fit For a second I was thinking like what is she doing there? But he was all alone. I'm just double checking. Come on. Oh, I hate this part. I'm running, I'm running, I want to... I want to... I want to, I want to uh, explore this area as, much, as quickly as you can. So you don't spend uh, a lot of battery life. 
The darkest video ever. <laughs> we were, now we're watching about 20 minutes of pure darkness, pitch black. It was an awesome game, awesome video, yeah. Well, we wanted to escape the asylum. Isn't this what we want? Want it? I really... Th no, I, I had a... I had a dilemma. In a, in a fracture of a second. I thought that... Uh, it was, that we saw him that was intentional. That we can outrun him, but uh, the moment we were, um, the moment when we were close to the exit, I don't see anything. So don't worry. I will join you in the club. Yeah, he got us. We didn't reload battery. I forgot about that. Okay, now. Mm -hmm, prepare. Where is this, that light? Where, where are doors? Where are the... Okay, okay, now. Now you are... Over here. Okay. That is easy. Find Father Martin inside the female ward. We are not done. Okay, okay, okay. Die won't. I really thought that you were close. Okay, we have taken care of fe female, of male ward. Now we're going. Now we're entering female ward. Let's see what horror slays in there. Yep. True horrors. I mean, we saw um, scarier things. Don't drink the water. So much blood in the water, I can smell it. Like putting a pen in your mouth when you were a kid. The whispers are making more sense. I'm looking for static. It's like an itch. Hmm. Now this guy was stripped out of, out of his flesh. Not stripped out like it's flesh, but this flesh was stripped from his skeleton. Yeah. Can't go over four, huh? Let's go. Let's let's go. Let's bust in into female ward. <laughs> and you know what, guys? Because the female female ward is another another uh, part of the game. We're gonna end this episode here. So it, so you, so I can just name it as the darkest video ever. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding, guys. No, it, I think that we are we have more to play. A lot more than originally thought. I don't know. It's it's hard to find a balance. It's hard to figure out when to stop. That's why. Oh, what the hell we're You're gonna play? You're beginning to understand, but not yet. Even Abraham had to cast his eyes to the ground. But soon, soon, this way, revelation is at hand. Nope. We need to finish this. Yeah. The one thing I'm not. No, I don't 
I can figure it out. Why is he running? Can he? Can't he just wait for us at the entrance or somewhere, or maybe up there, so we don't have to do the chase? I know, I know. I'm now. I'm destroying the game. <laughs> no, it's good. It's good. But he could wait. He could have wait, wait, wait. But either way, um, one thing. Now I'm fearing that Wall Rider, some kind of a ghost. Which I didn't saw it. Maybe you will see it on a video uh, when you're gonna when you when you're gonna be watching this. But um, I think I saw a glimpse of a mist. But he said he just saw Wall Rider. I personally didn't saw it. Didn't see it. See it or saw it. I don't know which comes now in the sentence. <laughs> so bear with me. I saw something. You know, when you're hearing people uh, testifying when they s when they see a UFO, I saw something. I don't know what it was. <laughs> now I know how they feel. <laughs> well, either way, if you want to stay tuned for more episodes of Outlast, you can always subscribe and hit the notification bell button. Let me let me know in the, in the comments down below what you think about all of this thing that is happening currently. I'm just hoping I won't get any spoilers. Be careful about that. I draw Audi, you know that. Hmm. Have that on mind. In your mind. And this is all for today. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye bye.